Hello, this is Russ Soselski, Superintendent for Linden Community Schools. I'm here today to let you know that Linden Community Schools has put a non-homestead operating millage renewal on the August 3rd, 2021 ballot. This renewal would allow Linden Schools to continue to levy no more than 18 mills for a period of nine years or 2030. This renewal does not apply to primary residents and other exempt properties. It is only levied against properties considered non-primary residents, which are essentially businesses, industrial properties, and second homes located in our district. Under Proposal A, districts receive a foundation allowance, which is a per pupil funding amount that is determined by the state of Michigan each year. Part of the per pupil funding is the non-homestead operating millage. The state of Michigan assumes all districts, including Linden, levy 18 mills in local revenue. For Linden, this equates to about $2 million a year. Districts are capped at 18 mills, but may ask for additional mills as a protection against the Headley rollback. The Headley Amendment, which passed in 1978, requires that school districts to reduce its millage when annual growth on existing property exceeds the consumer price index. Therefore, the millage rate gets rolled back so that the resulting growth in property tax revenue is no more than the rate of inflation. Currently, Linden has a non-homestead operating millage of 20.3746 mills. Please remember, this is a safety net due to the Headley rollback and by law, districts are only allowed to levy a maximum of 18 mills. So why is this renewal important? This renewal is important to Linden schools because the current operating millage comprises about $2 million of our district's operating budget or about 6.6%. These funds are used to pay for staffing, school supplies, classroom supplies, student resources like textbooks and devices, and other resources needed to operate our district. Is the non-homestead operating millage new? No, the non-homestead operating millage is not new. This tax levy has been in place since 1995 under Proposal A. Will this increase taxes on non-homestead properties? No, this is a continuing tax, not an increase. Non-homestead properties will continue to pay the same millage rate that they are currently paying. Again, this is a renewal. So in summary, the Linden Community School District will have a ballot proposal on the August 3rd ballot. The non-homestead operating millage is for 20.3746 mills with a not to exceed levy amount of 18 mills. Linden Community Schools appreciates your support of our students. Have a great day. And as always, go Eagles.